Hi, um, I'm going to show you a simple way how to write a program that will uh, fill up your RAM and crash your computer, basically. And um, I'm using Visual Basic 6.0 here, and um, yeah, I'm going to go in for standard executable. And you could do this on any event, it doesn't really matter, but I'm going to put a command button in here. And I'm going to double click here to go into the coding. And I'm going to write a for loop. And uh, that for loop is going to say this. It's going to say for i equals 1 to 3, i equals 2, next i. That's all you need to write. That's for i equals 1 to 3, i equals 2, next i. It's that simple. Um, this is the second attempt, so it may actually crash the program again. But here's the current system processing, which is quite high, considering that um, I'm running quite a high quality recording program to record this for you. And I'm going to go ahead and play it. Hopefully it isn't going to completely demolish my computer. And here we go, and I'll click it and watch the difference. I'm going to try and close this right away. Uh, you can see it's gone up to over 90% CPU already and my computer is crashing and burning. So it, it, it's, it's quite some easy code and now my computer is completely screwed. I'm going to have to like abort this. There you go, I have a nice view on my desktop there. Um, yeah, so it's completely possible. You can see the big difference here. Um, you don't really need any skill to program to write as I just told you everything, but yeah, just remember not to send that to anyone without their permission and all the Data Protection Act, Data Misuse Act stuff. I guess I just gotta tell you that since this is going on in that. Well, have fun coding, guys.